Good morning you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today is check-in day. I'm so excited we hit a new low today. I am currently sitting at 125.8 pounds. Last week I was 127, which is perfect. It means that we're getting on track to show day. this m m coffee. I'm super excited to give this a try. I really hope it hits that chocolate craving. It smells really good. Honestly, the m m coffee didn't really hit, so I just went ahead and made myself my regular everyday Starbucks coffee, and I just added a little bit of almond milk and then sugar-free vanilla syrup. I have my eggs cooking right now, and I'm gonna make my oatmeal, and then I'm just gonna show you guys the supplements that I take every morning. So I take these hair, skin, and nail gummy vitamins. I honestly just take them because they taste like candy, and I love them. I also take these D3 supplements. These are in the dark chocolate flavor. I have been really on the chewable supplements just because it does add a little bit more excitement. And I also take this vitamin C every morning. And then I take a greens powder and a glutamine and my creatine. Breakfast is done. I've got one egg with 100 grams of egg whites and I've got my oatmeal here. I have blueberries in my oatmeal and peanut butter and like a dark chocolate sugar-free syrup. And then I am also gonna top off my oatmeal with this. I've been really loving this lately. It is the Sinfit sugar-free blueberry syrup. I really like it because it pairs well because I have blueberries in my oatmeal, so then it goes hand in hand together. You feel me? Then on my eggs, I use sugar-free maple syrup. Call me crazy, but I love it. I'm just gonna get ready to go to the gym. I'm just gonna put a little bit of makeup on and then head out. It's absolutely freezing in my place right now. This is my finished makeup look. I have gotten my lashes done religiously since I was in high school for like probably five or six years now. And I recently decided to get my eyelashes removed. So this is what I look like with no eyelashes. I kind of like having no eyelashes. However, I went and I bought a new mascara. I haven't used mascara in literally years, but I've heard really good things about this one. It is the L'Oreal Telescopic. So I'm going to curl my eyelashes and put some mascara on and I'm going to see how it looks. I haven't quite decided what I want to wear to the gym yet, but I just got this new hoodie. It's the Abercrombie camo hoodie that's gone viral. Just got my hands on it, so I kind of want to create a gym outfit based off of this. I think this is the sports bra and the shorts that I'm gonna wear. This with the gray headband. Comment down below what you guys think I should wear. I'm kind of thinking no gray headband, but then I kind of also think that this adds to the fit. I don't know, I'm conflicted. It is time for my pre-workout meal, so I'm going to prep this, I get chicken, rice, peppers, a little bit of avocado, and top it off with a little bit of sauce. I am so excited to eat this meal right now. Let's prepare it. I literally put my meal plan in like one of these clear sleeves and I leave it on my counter or my fridge so I can make sure I'm doing everything correctly. Guys, two grams over, but like two grams still counts. Then I get 100 grams of chicken.
100 grams of peppers. Normally like a quarter of an avocado. Gonna top that off with my favorite skinny girl sauce. This is the raspberry vinaigrette. Taylor and Brie, I know you're watching this and I fuck it up with the sauce, I'm sorry. I love bell peppers and chicken. I could eat it every day. We're gonna make our intra workout. We're gonna take this shaker bottle and we're gonna make our pre-workout. So I'm using Big Boy Dry Scoop pre-workout in the flavor Just Peachy Diddly Dip. Full scoop of that. Then I've got PVL glutamine. Do a scoop of that. Then I've got PVL creatine. I only fill up my pre-workout halfway because otherwise it's too watery. Shake that up. Taste test tastes pretty good, but I'm not gonna drink the rest of it right now. I'm gonna drink it when I'm closer to the gym because it's still a 35 minute drive. Also, can't forget to bring my EAAs. These are from the brand TC Nutrition and these are in the flavor lemon iced tea. They're hydro amino acids. So they got essential amino acids, glutamine, electrolytes, all in one. I'm gonna put it in this little travel container. I like to drink EAAs well. I'm working out just to keep myself hydrated since I am in a deficit. It's good to keep your body as hydrated as possible so you still have energy and you can still make it through the day. This gum is an essential. I love it. I eat it religiously. And in between meals, it is the savior. I'm gonna bring the whole pack with me because I like to chew it while I work out too. Really can't decide what shoes I wanna wear with this outfit. If I should go with the gray lows or should I do a pop of color and go with the J's? Just got to the gym, gonna be hitting in upper body day. I'm doing chest, shoulders, and tries, so yeah. I don't know if I'll film the whole workout just because my camera might die again, but I will try to get as much footage as I can. pre-weighed my potatoes. I get 180 grams of potatoes for meal three. So I'm just gonna stab these with a fork and then pop them in the microwave. And while that is in the microwave, I'm going to weigh out my chicken and my vegetables. Okay, I'm just waiting for the potatoes, but for this meal, I'm using the Skinny Girl sauce, but this is the Honey Dijon Mustard sauce. This one's really good too. I'm going to meal prep some chicken that I have for tomorrow and the next few days and I'm just gonna cook it in my air fryer. For seasonings, I'm just going in with some seasoning salt. I also like to use some ground paprika. And then for a little bit of kick, I like to add some cayenne pepper to the top too. 
I'm gonna pop this in the air fryer at 375 for 20 minutes and it will come out perfect every time. While the chicken's cooking, I'm just gonna pop in some laundry. This is all the laundry I've had from the week. This is the behind the scenes of what they don't tell you about prep. Going to the gym twice a day and working full time means that you have a lot of laundry. Like I go through three outfits a day, which means I have three outfits to wash times seven. So I'm just gonna get a head start on that. I feel like I'm constantly doing laundry. It's like a never ending thing. Next on the agenda is to get my 45 minute cardio session done. I like to wear all black to my cardio sessions because I sweat like a mother trucker. This is the cardio fit. I just have this one shoulder Aritzia sports bra and then I have Aritzia biker shorts. And then I'm just gonna throw this crew neck over top. Honestly guys, I'm 13 minutes in it and I'm already exhausted. I'm on the elliptical because that's what my coaches told me to do. And I'm on here for 45 minutes. I have to have my heart rate between 135 to 140 beats per minute. And I'm already sweating, but I will update you guys when I'm almost done. Cardio is finished for the day. As much as I hate cardio, there's something exhilarating about finishing 45 minutes of cardio. Like, they talk about runner's high, and I feel like I get that doing my cardio. And it's honestly just a really good feeling. Cardio is finished, time for meal four. Honestly, these packs of rice are a lifesaver. I'm just gonna pop this in the microwave. Well, that is in the microwave. I get 100 grams of green beans, so I'm gonna weigh that. Add a little bit of water so they can steam it and then once the rice is done I'm going to throw this in the microwave but in the meantime I'm going to measure out my beef. This is my meal for we've got ground beef, rice, and green beans and I'm going to top this meal off with some Frank's hot sauce. So something that doesn't get talked about enough during your prep journey is prioritizing rest and recovery. So it is currently nine o'clock and I am just starting to wind down to go to bed. I'm gonna get in the shower. I'm going to have an Epsom salts bath first. This is really gonna help get magnesium into my muscles. Just finished my shower. I had the most relaxing Epsom salts bath. It was so good for my muscle recovery. Just eating my last meal now. I get 20 grams of oats, 20 grams of protein, and 10 grams of peanut butter, and I top that off with some sugar-free strawberry syrup. I'm just going to eat this, wind down, and then pretty much head to bed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Turn on the little bell so you get the notifications when I upload my next video, and I will see you guys all in my next video. Bye.